as you grow and as you age and as you mature, uh, your values change. And you know, so what would you say is specific needs for different people? Like, I, ultimately, when it comes to real estate, there's a need that you need to solve, and that's what you need to um, identify first. So, what do you think is that the first step in deciding which type of real estate you want to invest in? Yeah. So, I mean, uh, in the first quarter. Um, someone probably needs more cash flow, which means you want to pay the bills, meet the month end bills. So you're looking for a more cash flow, an investment that generates money at the end of the month. In the second quarter, you're looking more for stability. In other words, cash flow is important, but you want something to grow while you're working. So appreciation and mortgage pay down is very, very important. Uh, in the third quarter, uh, an extension of mortgage pay down and appreciation is important. But also you need cash flow as well because now you're taking care of maybe a parent, maybe a young adult who's moved back in, or perhaps your life has changed and you've decided after 35 years you want to just do your own thing. And now you're into a brand new business. That safety net of a corporation is not there for you anymore. And so therefore now you need a little bit of cash flow. And the fourth quarter, it's more to do with uh, not as much making cash flow, but seeing that your legacy lasts or whatever you've bought is going, in value, going up in value. So again, when you're younger, maybe a buy, fix, sell would generate more money for you. Uh, mid, to, mid ages, buy and hold, you're increasing value, getting cash flow, and later on in life, again, you're hoping to have investments that pay off, uh, pay for you. In other words, syndicated mortgages, if they're correct, um, mix, if they're correct, and also uh, investing in larger buildings with other partners where you don't have to do the heavy lifting, but it's making money for you as well. And that's a great important part because mm -hmm. that's why I feel like real estate's for everyone. Yeah. Because when you're young, you can focus on cash flow, you can focus on building equity so that you're able to create wealth. And then for an older person, it's more about security and setting yourself right. up for retirement.